<laughs> That's so satisfying. What's up, my beautiful babes? You are looking so beautiful per usual. You always looking stunting, okay? And I love you so much. So you guys, I'm back with more America's Next Top Model makeover reaction videos. And I know it's been a while and I missed it. And I'm back and I'm gonna watch, what is this, season five. We're watching season five today. We're going back again. <laughs> We're just jumping all around seasons. I don't know. Um, and this looks like a great makeover episode. I don't remember this episode at all, but I'm so stoked to watch it again with you guys. So you guys know the deal. You've seen my videos before, I'm sure. So with that all said, you guys, let's get it started. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> okay, <laughs> get myself back in this chair. <laughs> Wake the up, up, up girls. It was shocking. I actually am just really, really. Yes, lips. I'm out of breath from that whole dance. <laughs> I, don't that yeah, it's weird. I, I remember her. She was gonna be at all. I am so competitive, and I'm trying to make like something oh my great. She's crazy. You can't underestimate. For one second, one of these skeezers here. Huh? You can't. If you show skeezers. weakness, they're gonna pounce on you like a pack of hyenas to a <laughs> 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 Nope, bitch, I'm about this hairy situation, but be ready and leave at 8.45 a.m. <laughs> I'm so the way I look, and I think I present myself very well. I have a great natural beauty, and I don't think I really need to change much to it. Okay, confidence. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so 19, like 90s with the white limo. How are you? Good. Are y'all ready to bitch and moan about a hair situation? No. Well, of course you know where you are, right? You're in the hair salon, but not just any hair salon. You're in the Louis Lacari hair salon. This is Mr. Louis Lacari himself, model. Oh, this is so old. We have an idea for everybody. We're going to turn you girls into these bling top models. I mean, like Linda Evangelista became a huge supermodel when she cut her hair all short. That was such a lot. Alrighty, I'm gonna start with Nicole. We're gonna give you hair weave and make you even more curly and more fabulous and more value. That sounds great. Friend, <laughs> you're gonna actually be a blonde. Oh god, not weave. <laughs> Diane, we are gonna give you wheat color like on a prairie. Okay. Let me see, Lisa. I think that the hair should give more contrast to the eye color. If we make your hair color richer, chocolatey, all of a sudden your blue eyes are just going to pop. I'm like Linda Evangelista, man. I'm a chameleon. Come on. I want something really drastic. Ebony, we thought and thought, and then we said she needs glamour, she needs pizzazz, and she needs to represent how people grow. And you're gonna have braids all the way down to here. Ah! We you have braids. We're gonna make your hair chocolatey brown. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Jayla, bring it on. We wanna take you from here to here, honey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ira. I'm definitely not expecting to get. My hair, oh my god, Kim, I remember Kim. I mean, you can't have the luxury of hair, it's like too much. We love the length of your hair, but you have this kind of olivey colored skin that I think would be great red. People who choose to be red choose to be noticed, so watch out. Louis Lacari is so tacky. symmetrical <laughs> haircut. Okay, Nick, you have such a honey colored complexion. As I'm wearing hair might be a bit gems in my face. Dress. So we're gonna take you Calling brighter, we're gonna make you such a tacky. Three, we're gonna just straighten you out and make you bone straight and sexy. Cassandra, you have poise. You are a beautiful woman. But in that judging room, all the answers are right because you're a beauty queen. And it's kind of bland. It's safe. It's like, who is the real girl up under all that hair? So you know what I'm doing? Have you ever seen that movie, Rosemary's Baby, starring Mia Farrell? 
Nope. You haven't? Well, I'll explain what her hair looked like in that movie. It was a little bit Oh, it's so than cute. Yours, and it oh, I love that. Short. Oh yes. my god. She's gonna she's gonna cry. So you know she's gonna cry. Just cutting this just to cut your hair. Oh, no. fits Here comes the tears. Your face is strong enough to handle that. Cassandra, why are you crying? I love my hair. I love my hair. I had sex for her, but it's like you really gotta do what you gotta do because it's the opportunity. That's right, it. Ebony. Get also, it. What you guys are gonna be doing is these girls are so young. Today. You're going to be representing God. these looks. I'm ready. Oh, We're gonna start now. Let's do it, Ty. Let's do this. These girls are attacking this poor girl. Oh my god. They're all watching. <laughs> That's so satisfying. It's okay, you're ready. No more beauty Do you know what? You're gonna look so great, you don't even know. Wow, it's a lot of hair. That's the tea right there. Is that the color they gave her? I just spit oh, everywhere. Oh my god, the weave. These poor girls. The, oh, oh, braiding. We're doing like box braids. Or like tiny box braids. Whoa. Up on hair. <laughs> Did she take 12 hours? You're a little more like the, the ghetto fab girl. I guess that just means I'm fabulous one way or another. Oh my god. It was nothing drastically done to me. If he said that in 2018, ghetto fabulous, girl, the whole internet would have a frenzy over that. Like, would they would go crazy. Ghetto fabulous. That is so bad. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wait, he looks she looks amazing. What? She told me it's that my new look stunning. is going to be like 90s supermodel, kind of like the wide-eyed supermodel. <laughs> oh my and god, this is so 90s. Hair, and that's exactly what I got. The poof. The snooky poof. I'm really pumped up about it. I want you to like it's the early Oh my god, these highlights. Seriously, I didn't even think I'm this living for her fun. though. She's like Better and it's easier Those to lips. Oh, she looks great. Oh yeah, that haircut is way better on her. I'm the only person who's been told to stay completely in my personal style. Femboy. <laughs> the faux hog. Oh no. Yes. Oh, she... I wanted blonde hair and I wanted it long, but. I at least got the long hair. Oh no, it's like eating her alive, that hair. 
way too she much. Hooked me up. <laughs> she made me look beautiful, so I'm happy with it. Yes, Diane, give me that soccer mom hair. <laughs> I never would have thought blonde at all, but overall, I like my makeover. Um, I, I actually like that on her. I think it blends with her skin tone a little bit too much, but it's pretty. You're kind of like that sophisticated young model, so you bring notice to yourself by being fashionably casual. I love the finished product. It's amazing. I what they do. Oh, oh wow. Her skin looks like healthier with darker hair. I really like that. Okay, makeovers. Season whatever this is. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Lioness. See what I did there? Nick looks great. I just got in the chair and I knew I was going to be sitting and it took 13 hours. At the end of the day, it looked so awesome, so I didn't really care. 13 minutes. Hours. How do you get that out of your hair? These braids are like microscopic. Obviously, I'm still gonna be a feminine person because that's how I am. What would bother me most? Oh the no, this is, is said, bad. No, you can't act feminine anymore. A lot more kind of mod, a little more edgy. You have to act bad. Edgy. That's just really, 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 really bad. I mean, she's like really, really pretty. Oh, actually, well, that picture's kind of stunning. So you guys <laughs> take that back. I take it I back. Each and every one of you about what your new style should be. So you need to start to adopt that. So you take on that supermodel, top model persona. Thank Work you. it out. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Woo. Okay, girl. Those makeovers were actually like pretty good. Like I'm kind of surprised. That's a very, very old season. What was it? Season five? Season five. And the makeovers like weren't that dated. Like they were a little bit dated, but actually looks really chic and beautiful on like 90% of them. And like there was nobody who got like a really, really, really ratchet makeover. And I'm obsessed with Nick's, Nick, N-I-K, her hair. Stunning, the lion hair, like that beautiful afro sort of like really curly kinky hair oh looked amazing on her such a transformation i also liked the girl who ended up getting her hair cut really short who was crying i we would think it looked really good i think the color should have been a little bit blonder first blonder for her skin tone but what are you gonna do about it it looked chic it looked dope she looked so much better so much more of a model i was into it and today's instagram shout out goes to these two queens looking fabulous she says, hey queen, my fiance and I love watching your videos together. She introduced me to you. We both home dye our hair and usually it goes pretty well. We are getting married next month. Congratulations, that's amazing. And are going to the hairdresser beforehand to get our hair done properly. Good idea. <laughs> do you think I should go all pink? The orange was on purpose. Leah has no idea what to do with her hair as it is long on top, but she's growing out. She's growing up the back and sides. Any ideas? Thank you so much. Okay, for yeah, congratulations like, once again. You guys are so cute. Oh my God, I, oh, I'm so happy for you. Okay, and yes, you should definitely go all pink. Are you kidding me? Is that even a question with me? Like, I want everybody to have pink hair and blonde hair. So <laughs> yes, definitely pink hair on you. And your fiance, I mean, I'm digging the purple. I think you guys should both go like completely pink and completely purple because like that would just look so rad at like a wedding you guys getting married with like pink and purple hair i think that would be such an iconic look and i'm so here for it so i mean that's what i'm into i mean or if you guys want to do more of like an ombre kind of feel you could always do like a darker root with like lighter pink ends or like a darker pink on the top a lighter pink on the bottom something cool like that i don't know if you go to the hairdresser you might as well mix it up a little bit um, or even you, yeah, dark pink on the top, light pink on the bottom. And then your fiance could do like a dark purple on the top to a light pink or a light purple. I don't know, it just, I feel like you should have fun with it. And definitely stick with the purples and pinks because I'm obsessed and you guys look fabulous. So congratulations and good luck at your wedding. It's gonna be amazing. I'm so excited for you. Let me know if you guys end up um, doing this to your hair and definitely send me a picture of you at your wedding day. I can't wait to see it. Don't forget to check out my merchandise at fanjoy.co slash Brad. Thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your extra life and I will see you all next time.
Peace.